So guys, for the first method, you wanna head over to search and type in run, click on it. And now once you're on this, you wanna copy and paste the code, which will be down below in the description. You should copy this, paste it right here into run, and then click on okay. That will then reset Microsoft OneDrive for you. See if that works. And now for the second method, you wanna head over to search and type in OneDrive, click on it. And now the OneDrive cloud will appear on your taskbar. If you do not see it, you wanna click on the arrow, you should see it right here. Now once you find the OneDrive Cloud, you want to right click on it. And then click on Quit OneDrive. Click on Quit OneDrive again. Now you want to search for OneDrive again. Click on it. See if that works for you. And now for the third method, you want to head over to Search and type in Check for Updates. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Check for Updates. Make sure that your computer is fully up to date. See if that works for you. And now for the fourth method, you want to head over to search again and type in add or remove programs. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to scroll down until you find Microsoft OneDrive. You want to click on the three dots, click on uninstall, and then uninstall it. And then click on yes. You want to uninstall OneDrive. And now once you've uninstalled OneDrive, you want to head over to search again and type in Microsoft Store. Click on it. And now once you're on this, you want to search for OneDrive. Click on it. And then click on get. You just want to re download it again. Now, once you've installed that, you just want to restart your computer, and then the problem should be fixed. 